into Cafe Boerant. I don't know, but this coffee is really interesting. It's good though. It's cold brew infused with maple and stuff. I don't know. Interesting. Of course, I had to stop and take a video of the pigeons. But after the morning coffee, we were headed to the Nintendo store and a couple of other places to look at stuff. We crossed St. Peter's Cathedral on the way. So I went in it last time I was here. It's pretty sick. So many people. I wonder what was going on today. I never did find out what was going on. Because like the streets are all closed down. So obviously there's something going on. I think it might have been a parade or something, but I don't know. Rockefeller Center, but St. Patrick's Cathedral. I don't think we really knew where we were going, so we were wandering around Rockefeller Center, just hoping we arrived at the right location. We ended up in a building too. Oh shit! Yep. It's skating. I truly thought they only did ice skating. It's so shiny. I came across this fountain you could like go in, like the water would stop and you could run into the middle and then it would go up again. I wanna go in, see it. I don't need to wait, wait a second. I'm a child, but ooh, hell yeah. Oh, I got wet. <laughs> Here's a better view of the famous rink. I thought it was only an ice rink, but turns out they do rollerblading too. But now I had to turn around. Ew, <laughs> got their mouth open. Ick, I went in there, it was good, it was good. A regular toy store? Oh, it's got the Target dog on it. I immediately knew I had to check out this toy store. They had so many things. It was truly every child's dream. They had like a million stuffed animals, figures, games, everything you could have wanted as a child. I was having a great time. I also thought these rainbow stairs were really neat. Also turns out this is the store where the foot piano is. It's like Rainforest Cafe all over again, but no. Eek. Is that actually the time? Yeah, it is. Oh, it actually works. It's a working clock. I went back downstairs and turns out you can go into the clock. Very interesting, but pretty cool. Finally made it to the Nintendo store, our original goal for the day. Like Luchador Pikachu, oh my god. That's beautiful. Why would they make this? No, that's so sad. Oh my god. These are cute. Holy shit. Oh, never mind, it's beanie. The new Splatoon game had just come out, so if you were really brave, you could play on the big screen against people. I can tell my Pikachu. Oh, 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 there's Pikachu. <laughs> After getting all of my silly selfies with the figures, it was time to head to the M&M store in Times Square. Oh, yeah, suddenly we're here, okay. You're welcomed into the M&M store by a giant Elvis Presley M&M? Interesting. Those were choices. The Statue of Liberty M&M was also interesting. I didn't think you could make this many things surrounding M&Ms. One cool thing you can do here is make a custom bag of M&Ms. So they have all the colors separated out and then you fill little bags with whatever colors you want. Times Square. Halloween 
theme is cool. Wow. It didn't take me long to figure out what it really was. Oh, it's Rapunzel theme. Oh my god, these are really cute. <laughs> oh good god, that is so scary. I don't think we have to go too far. I guess I have no idea where we're going at this point. I didn't know where we were going, but it was also farther than I thought. Turns out, it was mochi donuts. Here we are again. There's the art. I was here, I came in here last time I was in New York, so. This store is Kinokuniya. It's a Japanese bookstore and like stationery store. They have a ton of pens and manga and everything Japan. It's so cute in here. All these like little felt things they have. Oh my god. I wish I was any good at these. All the like stationery stuff. Ooh, washi tape. And stamps. They had more pen colors and pen nib sizes than I had ever seen in my life outside of Japan. They also had washi tape and these super cute cat theme stuff. Like there was a black cat with like his big old eyes. He's so cute. And they also had like towels with them on it. Ugh, I love it. No. Oh, they're so cute. Look at them go. Oh. I'm going on my own adventure to I Milky. Oh no, there's a giant line. I might have lied. The line wasn't so bad. The store was just really small. This boba was different, and like the whole point is that you, they don't stir it, you shake it up yourself. So they serve it to you and they go, Do you know how to do this? Got the boba. That's all we were trying to do. A lot of work for that. It's fine. It's good. We're good. I'm gonna shake it though. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Dinosaur, what is that? It's only 9.30. Oh. The entrails of New York Comic Con. People are gone now. New York at night really is special. Then randomly, we came across it, the vessel at Hudson Yards. It's right there. You see people go in it, but it's definitely not open this late at night. That's it. Thanks if you made it all the way through, and I'll see you next time.